Hello, I'm Natasha Foreman. Welcome to the Breaking Bread with Natasha podcast, where I share daily devotionals from my namesake blog. So you can listen on demand to spiritual messages inspired by God's love as expressed in the Bible and other religious texts. You can read along at breakingbreadwithnatasha.com or sit back and take in the word. Either way, I'm blessed to have you break bread with me. Without further delay, let's begin today's message. Welcome, Breaking Bread family. This is Natasha Foreman. Thank you so much for joining me today. Let's look at the book of Judges, chapter 13, lines 2 through 5. And the translation that I'm reading says, The angel of the Lord appeared to her and said, You are barren and childless, but you are going to become pregnant and give birth to a son. Now see to it that you drink no wine or other fermented drink and that you do not eat anything unclean. You will become pregnant and have a son whose head is never to be touched by a razor because the boy is to be a Nazarite, dedicated to God from the womb. He will take the lead in delivering Israel from the hands of the Philistines. There's nothing God can't do for you, through you, and to you. Believe and have faith. That barren woman gave birth to a son, Samson, and he did exactly what God's angel said he would. Are you listening for God's voice? Are you paying attention to the angels around you who are trying to guide you? That faint voice in your head sharing words of encouragement and enlightenment, declarations of a successful future are not your mortal thoughts or imagination, but rather God planting spiritual seeds and outlining your roadmap. Tune in and stay connected. Let's pray on it. Father, thank you for making a way out of no way, for making the impossible possible, the crooked straight, and bringing light to darkness. I love you, Lord, and know that you will always make things right in my life, deliver me from bad situations, and direct my path even when I stray. Thank you, Father. And with that, family, I pray that you are blessed, that you see and embrace your blessings, and that you're a blessing to others. I love you all. Make today an awesome day. Take care. Hi, family. If what I shared in today's message resonates with you, I hope you will share it with others. Feel free to leave positive comments and reviews on my site, breakingbreadwithnatasha.com and through whichever podcast provider that you're listening to me. Each day, I work to be a better steward and servant. I hope you will join me in sharing God's love and truth and rebuking the enemy's lies. Now go out there and make today an awesome day. I love you all.